all right so previously we have seen how we can create security group and how we can create a key pairs for our aws ec2 instance now we have reached at the stage where we can start our aws ec2 instance creation and for that purpose we will be needing here key pair and security group so we have already set inbound connection for our security group we are accepting here all tcp connection from all port and from all ip range all right now let's go ahead and uh, and create our ec2 instance so for that purpose we have to write here ec2 thereafter run instance all right then we have to provide here the image id for the ec2 instance which we want to give here so what type of image we want here all right that's mean ec2 instance and to know the image id of ec2 instance it's really important to get it from internet all right i mean from console otherwise what you can do here you can get it from here aws ec2 instance id all right now if you click on the first link or second link whatever link you get relevant all right then you will be getting their instance id uh, do we have here no these are the inst perhaps with the instance type we might get something all right from there we don't have but uh, but if you click on here at launch instance you will get but i was expecting that if i can get it from internet because uh, we are assuming that you do not have access to this this one so we should get it somewhere here perhaps here resource id this one so with this id is perhaps is it no all right so it's not that one anyway so you have to get this this one first all right so this id you have to remember this id whatever type of machine you want to create so it is saying that ec2 run instance image id now i want any particular type of machine here and uh, for the sake of simplicity we are going to use here a free tier eligible this one amazon linux 2 ami and uh, this comes with the 5 ps support and there are many things which are already installed here all right apart from that if you want anything else like this one here we have amazon linux ssd volume type and uh, few other tools like python ruby perl java etc are already and docker php mysql and other things are already coming so you can take this one otherwise if you want here a brand new ubuntu server you can take it but there would be a lot of things which you need to do all right so by default i'm going to select this one all right amazon linux 2 ami uh, perhaps i think this one all right so you can take this id all right and then you can paste that id here and with this count we are going to say here how many instance we want and we want here only one instance and then i'm going to say here the instance type i want here you see there this should be uh free tier eligible all right so i think which type of instance is this uh, let me see if we select it here then we should get here all type of instance all right so this is t2.micro do remember this t2.micro is coming under free tier eligible otherwise you might get charged all right so instance type is t2.micro then here the key name all right do, re do you remember the key name which we had created so the key name was if you don't remember this key name we can see it from here as well 
do we have here key pair no let's go ahead and get this uh, ec2 otherwise i think uh, it was kgp talkie dot pem all right perfect so it was a kgp talkie dot pem and uh, the key pair name was this one kgp talkie all right and once you get this information thereafter we have to pass here security group id which we want to attach with this instance all right so there is security group id and do you remember the security group id which we created earlier this one my sg group let's go ahead and get this one group id and now we need to paste it here once you get this uh, group id thereafter we will be also needing here a subnet id all right so there we have a subnet id all right so this is ec2 vvc the id of subnet to launch then stands into all right So these are the subnet which we can use here. All right, let's go ahead and we are attaching here the first subnet. All right. And after that, you need to hit the enter. It will take some time to create your uh, instance. It has successfully created our instance and it will take some time to boot up. And these are the information which it has uh, printed for us. And uh, there is owner ID, reservation ID, AMI launch index is 0, architecture is here a 64 bit, client token and lots of other information we are getting here. Alright, so a t2.micro instance is launched here and this is a private IP for this instance. all right and it is running at a vpc of this id and subnet id is this one so this information now let's one more thing here a state region that's mean in which state is it it is in pending state that's mean it is starting and if you once again re reload it you should see here a running instance is equal to one click on this one now you should be able to see there this instance is running here and this status is being checked here all right perfect superb congratulations you have successfully created here ec2 instance by using aws cli all right i'll see you next lesson